Here we have a very nice example of an early 1900s electricity is life uh, shock machine. It's uh, really a quackery device from uh, early 1900s. There is a, a metal plate inside the machine uh, from the manufacturer, which is the uh, Detroit Medical Battery Company, and a uh, patent date of uh, 1901. We see the uh, early original porcelain uh, tin sign front that doubles as the uh, cover to the coin box and the battery box, but it also has the uh, advertisement for the machine claiming that it is uh, it actually does not give a shock and is no danger, but instead is a cure for headaches, uh, neuralgia, rheumatism, and nervousness um, for just one cent. What's, uh, I don't know, personally, the thought of uh, having a machine uh, put electricity into me uh, makes me actually a little nervous, but uh, I guess uh, to each one's own. Um, machine's in nice working condition. Really good example of an early unrestored, well, gently restored specimen, I would say, right? So some uh, the nickel handles um, have been restored at one point, but still have some nice patina and wear to them. Uh, the lower cast iron cabinet is uh, intact. Uh, and unrestored uh, original condition, nice uh, top sign and uh, coin entry. Just a great example overall uh, with, again, great patina. Very heavy. These are <laughs> very solid cast iron. There are tabs on the bottom where you could uh, uh, screw mount it into a, uh, a base, presumably in a general store or maybe uh, other setting. But um, frankly, it's a, a pretty heavy machine. It doesn't move around too much on its own, even without being bolted down. Uh, operation is simple. Basically, the uh, this handle is the one that moves the uh, indicator, as you can see, and the left handle is fixed. Uh, the person in using the machine would put a coin in and then um, start to turn up this handle and would need to uh, hold the left handle as well with the other hand to complete the circuit and actually feel uh, the current traveling through. Um, would drop the uh, penny in the slot at the top, and basically then the... Uh, the handle as we start to advance it, we hear the uh, the buzzer kick in. That actually turns on the uh, electrode and starts the circuit. You'll hear the intensity change as we go up higher, and it would in fact. And then as soon as you start to reverse, it shuts the uh, system off, and that uh, requires another coin to uh, to go again. So this is the electricity is life machine from the Detroit Medical Battery Company, uh, early medical quackery machine from the turn of the century.